Back in high school, my brother used to work for a British car shop. And so going there, it's like a candy store. You see all these British cars. And that's how I started my passion for British sports car. I always wanted one, but the problem is these. They race them, they wreck them, they abuse them, they use them. So it took me a long time to find a really good specimen. Finally, I find this one. I bought this one. The last owner had it for 33 years. It was never raced, never wrecked, minimal rust. And I felt, wow, this is, it's a black plate California car. It has always been titled. And it is an honor for me to just enjoy the car and take it forward to the next decade or two or three. But I do drive this car everywhere. I drive them out and about. I go shopping with it. I go to the market. I park in different places. I don't have to worry about nicks, dings, and scratches because it's just a driver. It's not an immaculate, pristine car. But it is a usable car. You can use this. And you're driving around something that is special and unique that a lot of people enjoy. And the cool part, it is not a big dollar car. It's still a very obtainable vehicle. That's the reason why this a car like this is something that you can enjoy, you can keep, you can drive, you can show if you wanted to. And yes, you have to be your own mechanic, just to say. You have to really work on your own car. <laughs> or you gotta have a mechanic. Otherwise, these kind of cars are gonna be very kind of tricky because they always require love, care, and attention. But in many ways, you're developing a relationship with the car because you're working on it.